Hey guys, welcome to another review, Smokehouse Shisha Reviews, with the Coco Green Hookah Coals, pressed out of um, bamboo, oh, I'm sorry, uh, coconut, coconut uh, shells. Um, the, uh, the, the package is sadly, though, in German, so um, I'm guessing you cannot uh, read this. Um, what I think is quite neat is that they donate five cents to charity um, for every package you buy. Um, it's not a great amount, but if you see how much they, they sell off, it, it might actually be a big impact. So, um, Quite a neat thing. Um, they say here, minimum of one and a half hours smoking time um, and uh, up to 330 degrees. Which is actually the point. They don't have as much heat, but I'll get into that in a second. Here I have on top one of the cocoa greens. I'm gonna set the sharpness. Yes, uh, on top a cocoa green. On the bottom a um, Starbuzz Cocoa Buzz 2.0. So as you can see, it's about half a brick. Maybe a bit more than half, actually, as I can figure now. See, oh, it's better here. So you see, it's about half a brick. Um, and yeah, get right into the action. I'm gonna be smoking on my Kaya Shisha PNX 660 with the Amy eight hole power bowl kind of um, bowl, um, which I've uh, reviewed also. Go ahead and check out that video if you guys are interested in that. And, um, distance set up uh, with aluminum foil. Um, what can I say about the charcoal? Um, it doesn't give off as much heat as um, you'd maybe like, but um, it actually is quite neat for um, just an hour. A short session, just an hour smoking, um, it's perfect. It doesn't give off a lot of, um, um, how do I express that, um, bad smell when you turn it on, when you light the coals. Um, it's uh, a bit more than a Cocoa Buzz from Starbuzz, which I really think is one of the best coals right now. Um, but... Um, it, it's not too bad. You can still, I, I always light my coals inside this room, so um, you really don't notice um, a bad smell or anything really, um, which is quite neat. I love that when, when the coals don't smell that, that harsh. Um, for the ash, um, there's a lot of ash uh, building up once you've had them on. As you can see, there's a lot of ash right now already after maybe 10, 15 minutes. So not quite as convenient as it could be, but um, I just said in the German review also, um, which is quite neat, is that the um, the coals would probably go very, very well on a Hotshot RT overpacking setup, which I'm going to be doing for you guys also because there was a, re a request on it. Um, I'm going to do that soon. And a, yeah, so quite neat. Um, but um, not perfect, as I would say. Um, they have some disadvantages. First of all, heating or, or uh, a d degree level. And um, on the other hand, um, ash building up and some bad smell, which is not really bad, but it's, it's, uh, it, could get, it could be better. So um, if you guys have any suggestions what I could do better for you, um, just go ahead and please write down below the video some uh, some comments. Um, I'll try to work on that. Um, I'll try to make it more interesting for you guys. I'll try to be um, to to correct the stuff that you say. Or if you have a video request, if you'd like to see something reviewed in English, go ahead and just uh, post down below, and I'll try to get that for you going. Um, yeah, Coles. I would give them a seven or a seven and a half out of ten. Um, 
It's not too good. It's okay. Um, you can buy it. If you guys love the charity fiend, go ahead and go for that. Um, you're definitely doing something good. Um, I don't know if you guys can get this stuff in the U.S. I'm not sure about that. But if you guys do, go ahead and just write a comment. I'd love that. Um, I'd uh, love to inform myself a bit more about that also. Um, yeah. In that um, take, I'll just say... Thanks for watching. I'll see you in another review. Give it a, give us a thumbs up and then subscription if you guys like the video. Thanks.